Hi, welcome back. Today I'm going to show you how to download a backup copy of all of your emails in Gmail. This can be helpful for if you're moving to a new Gmail service and need to import all of these emails into your new account, or just or maybe just for your own record keeping. It's always good to have these on hand in a it's always good to have these on hand in a second location. So where I am right now is myaccount.google.com. And from here, we'll click on Personal Info and Privacy. And in the Personal Info and Privacy, we'll go to Control Your Content on the left side here. And here you can see Download Your Data. Create an archive with a copy of your data from Google products. So we'll click this. And what this does, it takes us to takeout.google.com. So that would sort of be the shortcut way to get here. I thought I'd show you the longer way just so you could have a little bit more context of where you're located in Google Apps and how to get there if you forget takeout.google.com. So here you can see all of the different Google products. You can download copies of all of these right now. We'll just do Gmail, so we'll uncheck all of these. And then we'll click Customize Download Format, which is Next. So we'll click Next. And you probably want to do a zip because this will be a lot of data. So that's a great way to store large amounts of data. There are other file types, such as a .tgz or a .tbz file. But zip is usually the best way to go here. And you can choose two delivery methods. You can either send a download link via email if you want to download it locally onto your device. Or you can do what I'm going to do and uh, add the zip to your drive. So that way you can just find it right in your Google Drive. But if you're getting rid of your Google Apps account after this, it would make more sense probably to save this locally to your device. So now we'll create the archive. And this will take a couple hours and sometimes even days, depending on how many emails you have. But it will show up as a zip file in your drive once it's done. Or you'll get an email with a link to download it once it's finished. So since this takes so long, I won't be able to show you the end result right now, but that is how you download all of your emails. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comment section. Thank you and have a great day.